Hello and welcome to today's vlog. I'm in the town of Rye. I am Rye, a historic town. Look at that, a lovely little castle thing. And right next to it, a Thai restaurant called the Lemongrass. Right, let's go and see what this town's all about. Yeah, it was a naval yard, a uh, naval um, base, right? And then, uh, because there is a river running by it in 1336. But lovely little town, look at the brickwork. The murder holes, wow, beautiful. And we see a lovely viewpoint up there. Many Japanese come to visit this town, it is beautiful. Yeah, not much to see there. As we go in, very old buildings as well in this town. Beautiful January day, sun's out. A lovely day for a vlog. You will see some historic houses. I've been here for the jazz festival. I think that's about in, I think June time. Very good, the jazz festival here. Well worth a visit. As you will see, this is the most beautiful quaint British town. Look at that, the viewpoint. You can see the estuary down there that runs through the sea. The bowling green. Beautiful. Wow. English flag and Ukraine flag flying gracefully. Wow. Right. Let's have a look. Look at these old buildings. There's even older buildings up here dating back to the 13th century, even a haunted pub, which I will show you. An old fashioned sweet shop, lovely gift shops. Right, let's have a look. Yeah, very dated. There are some nice pubs up here as well. It is the old fashioned sweet shop. Look at that. Don't make them like that anymore. All in the jars. Quarter of tree nuts, sir. <laughs> yeah, I remember them days. Pick and mix. Wonderful days. Look, lovely art, right art. Can't go wrong here for your art. Beautiful artwork. Lovely, look. There's where we'll be heading. Down there. Look, you get an idea of this town. Look at that, the old cobblestones. Hey, we're on the cobbles, eh? Coronation Street. We'll walk up there and we'll have a look. What's what? Oh. Rye Castle Museum. There's a guitar shop up here somewhere because I remember from the music festival. I expect it done a good trade. I think it might be the other street. Lovely little town. Very quaint. Gonna knock us some fish. <laughs> Wow, the Union of Rye, how lovely. Paul Nash, artist lived here, 1889 to 1946. Wow, as we'll be coming up to the historic part in a minute. You do not want to miss out on the historic part of Rye. Beautiful. The courthouse. <coughs> right Town Council. Yeah, here's where the jazz festival was. The guitar shop's down there on the rock. Yeah, I remember we had cake in here. Look at this. 
the music trading company that's what it's called and look how old these are look at the door look at that that's the pub we sat watching the old music festival and look a church here welcome to st mary's beautiful eh? you can even go in the church in the windows look at the windows fantastic wow beautiful church you can go up to the tower wonderful church In time, some sort of time walk around here. Wonderful, look at the detail on the windows. Wow, stained glass, stained glass windows, beautiful. What a wonderful footpath! Beautiful, quarter boys' cottage, wonderful. What else is here? We walk through to the old part. Here is the old part of the place. Wonderful place. Yeah, nice. Look at that. Look at the old buildings. Let's get a close up of these old buildings. You can see why the, the Japanese visit here because it is quintessential British. Wonderful place. Look at that. Wonderful. What an old house. A lovely old house. Look at that. The old doors. A wonderful road. Cobbles. We're on the cobbles. Na, 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 na. No, it's not Coronation Street Cobbles. Look through here. We'll have a look what's down this way. Look at that. Post office. It's a wonderful place. Absolutely wonderful. And look at this building. Church Square this is called. You see why. We're right near the church, but look at this. How English is that? Wow. Very English. You don't get much more English than this. Look at this. Private, you can't walk along there. Look, how lovely. An English listed building. Cannot be knocked down. It is a listed building. Hello. The dogs have gone crazy up there. Wow. Look at it. Stunning. I will show you this pub. East Sussex County Police. So that was a police place there. Give you an idea of the square. Oh, look at this, an old prison. This is what I wanted to see last time. You can see the estuary better up there, but still lovely houses. And it is open. This is where they put the prisoners. Prisoners were held there. You can see, look, no escape. All right, 
What's this? A prison? Uh, it became a prison, yes. Become a prison. Wow. How much is the entry? Uh, five pounds. It's okay to film? Absolutely fine, yeah. Okay, brilliant. Okay, there's the fiber. Oh, thank you. Where do I walk? Through there? Uh, well, there's uh, basically three three floors in the building, so the oh, main well, room is through that. Main room. We see the main room. And, and then room. there's a room down here. Cool, I like the guns. <laughs> and then when you finish inside this building, if you go back out through that door and turn right, there's an entrance into the herb garden, and then there's a tower, which was the room. Okay, brilliant. Thanks a lot. Thank you. Wow. How old is it? That door's well old. Uh, it's built between 1215 and 1350 as a fortress. Blimey. 1250. Wow. What a privilege. And look at this. This is what they would have worn. Wow. And the boats or some sort of trap. Oh, well, for five, and look, a prison room. Wow. And you see the boats in the estuary. Wow. Amazing place. A bell, a town choir. Bit of history here, yeah, look. Police. Oh, look at that old boat. Amazing. And we're going to see a herb garden. Look at that. The Hawkehurst gang. Yeah, these were smugglers. Smugg I remember reading about this. Smugglers' times. Oh, look. A smugglers' song by Rudyard Kipling. If you wake at midnight and you hear a horse's feet, don't go drawing back the blinds, nor looking in the street. Them as ask no questions, then it was a lie. Oh boy, my darling, I was gentlemen go by. Five and twenty ponies, trotting through the dark. Brandy for the parson, back into the crowd. Brandy for the parson, Watch the wall, my darling, while the gentlemen go by. Running round the woodland, if you chance to find little barrels, ropes and tarred, all full of brandy wine, don't Not you shout to come and look, nor use them for your play. Put the brushwood back again, and they'll be gone next day. If you see the stable door setting open wide, if you see a tired horse lying down the side, is your mother meant to hold? It's enough of her. She's banging on. What's this? Some sort of war plan room. I'll press another button. Pre Roman. Pre Roman. Oh, that's how the water went. Navigational waters. That, they all light up. What's that? Mar Martello Towers, Rye. Look, there's Rye. Call that woman still banging on. Bit of history for you. Let's go right up in the tower. No entry. No entry. I think we've explored all this bit, haven't we? Access to view terrace, viewing terrace. We didn't do this bit. Wow. As you can see, there is a view of the terrace. That must be the herb garden down there. Depends what sort of herbs you like. Look at it. Right. Let's go and look at something else and I'll show you that haunted place. Wow. Let's go and explore more of this.
That's what they used to put on the ships, weren't it, in the old days? Um, let, let, let the crows eat. <laughs> uh, yes, I guess. Um, what the seagulls? Probably found many, many places to use them. It's barbaric, isn't it? <laughs> I mean, generally speaking, the, the uh, victim would have already been hung. Yeah. It was just a. Uh, Jesus. I'll have nightmares tonight. <laughs> Sorry? I'll have nightmares tonight. Yes, <laughs> wow. High security cell where John Breads was confined prior to his execution. 8th of June 1742. Blimey. What's that downstairs? There's more to it. Yes. Oh, right. Do not touch. These are the herbs. I suppose that, that was their medicine back then, wasn't it? The herbs, I suppose. Yeah. They didn't have much. Look, a crossbow. Could you be an archer? Oh, I probably could have. Yep. I could have been an archer. <laughs> Look at this. Will this work? Sir Knight. Wow. Amazing place. Uh, if you want to pause it. Bit of knowledge for you. Wow. Uh, wow, nothing's getting through that. It's amazing how they used to chain them. Wow. The chapel. Amazing. The Middle Ages. Right, let's go and see this haunted place. We've we got time. Excellent. Thanks a lot for that. Go and see the haunted place down there. It's a pub, isn't it, down there? Yeah, yeah, down that, that way. Pub down there where all the stars stay. They've got the pictures. Brilliant. Thanks a lot. Cheers. Shut the door, keep him warm. There's the herb guy. Oh, look, I'll show you these stockades. Women's Tower this way is where they held the women. We'll have a look. Oh, yeah. As we paid a fiver, get our money's worth. These are the herbs we used to grow. The women's towers. See, the women prisoners were in here. Wow, someone in here. Hello, are you a prisoner? Good God, you made me jump. And here you shall stay until two weeks hence. That is your bed, Jane. Sit down upon it and listen to me. All right, ma'am. You are to keep yourself and this cell clean. When the bell rings at six in the morning, you will rise immediately. 
and be ready to take your slop bucket for emptying and your water can to be filled. You will then sweep the cell, make your mattress into a neat roll and wash yourself. Bread and gruel will be brought at a 7.30. If you and Bread yourself and are not clean and neat as you may be at that time, you will not receive your ration. And not much of it, and stay in the Silence, Mary. <laughs> After breakfast, there will be prayers, and may they do you good. Then you will work until noon, picking oakum. At noon, there will be an hour of exercise and then dinner before you resume your work. With bleeding fingers and a back so oh, sore. Silence, Mary. You will have nothing but bread and water until the end of next week. Oh. Oh, that town, yeah. <laughs> bread and water. If you're into your herbs, there's all the herbs. Sight walk. Yeah, herbs. Right, let's go and see this haunted bit. Most haunt it was on the program, the haunted. Look at the anchor there. Well, that was interesting. It didn't make me jump when I went off the cord block. show you this lovely little place the haunted bit that was quite interesting that little museum for a fiver better than going up the tower there get a nice view of ride but here's the lovely part of ride I'll quickly show you this David Jason stayed here there is a picture of David Jason great actor one of the finest actors a lovely little cobble. We go back past the house that we've seen. That little crest on there. Wow. Little letterboxes in them days. Those small letters. Probably worth a lot of money, these houses. Look at that. Wonderful. As we walk down the cobbles, we shall see a bit more of Rye and the wonderful houses for a quaint Rye a little church there there's the old British post box there lovely place sweet then Watch Bell Street now, and there is a pub up here that I have been in, a lovely fireplace. I will have a drink here while we're here. for this pub I'm sure I am a church there it's quite newish compared to all the other brickwork oh, this is lovely yeah I think the uh, pub is the next street down which we will find Watch Bell Lane. Should we take Watch Bell Lane or should we carry on? So much to see here, you can cut through there. I think we're going round. Village Tea Room and Art Gallery. Wow. Flag flying gracefully. Oh, here is the pub. One of them. It's not the pub that I was in. The Hope and Anchor Hotel. As you can see, the estuary down there, all the boats are. It's high tide. There's a water that that is completely drained of water. 
fantastic place, look at there's so much to see here that was good at the uh, prison there, look, no idea the estuary <laughs>